Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover and thank you for joining me in episode 2 of this campaign in which we are going to try, and, or we will, get the Pat M or Communist route for the Aquilian Republic. Now if you're joining us here for the first time because this is technically a different thumbnail, uh, I've already played as Aquilian Republic but I went down the Harmony route. As you can see on screen that is a thumbnail for number the first episode of this if you'd like to check out that video. Um, that will be the first link in the description below. But for this one, we've already gone ahead and finished off, of course, Fight for Your Freedom. We did everything to prepare for the Civil War, and I don't really feel like fighting the Civil War again. So we're just going to go right on ahead and go with a Communist Pat. With President Crew, and we also get Battle Illiteracy, as was well Legally Abolish Monarchy. Oh, we can't do any of this stuff. Oh, we need more Deputy Day. So, let's go ahead and just Battle Illiteracy. Now, technically, technically, I've already read through, actually, this focus, because I played as a Supremacist Path. Um, I've, I've already done a lot of this stuff off screen, is, or not off screen, but I've, I've read a lot of that stuff before, so we probably won't read these again. But I guess for this one, we can quickly read this one. So, ignorance is a tool of tyrants, the weapon of warlords. Knowledge is a foundation that freedom rests upon. We shall make it our endeavor to teach griffins of all throughout the Republic how to read and learn, so they may become effective participants in our new everlasting democracy. And we're led by Grand Crew, which is looking kind of cool. If you'd like to read about him, please go ahead. We have better acceptance of communist diplomacy. Uh, advisor. Political advisor cost goes down by 25%. He was born in 1962, too. Gets slightly more daily common support, as well as 5% more political power every day, which is going to be very, very useful. And also, just be sure, um, <laughs> since I've already played as a supremacist route, or, or not supremacist route, I played as a harmonist, a harmony route. Oh, man, my words, my pronunciations. Woo! Going crazy here. We got to get 40 combat with infantry quickly. But right now, we are the Pat... And we can probably go ahead and whip the party so we can get some more support. That would be good. And go ahead and spend the political power for that. Anything else here? Uh, not too much. We can wait for this stuff. We have to do that stuff as well. But let's just go ahead and I'm going to go straight for 40 combat widths. Um, that's not bad. That's better though. Just because when, when we did the harmony route. Oh my goodness. That wasn't a bad route. But going to 40 combat width immediately is just so incredibly important. So, I'm interested to see to see what the route is like for the Quillian Republic when we go full-on communist route. That sounds like a lot of fun to me. I hope it sounds like a lot of fun to you, because then again, if it didn't sound like fun to you, then why'd you click on the thumbnail or the video? Thanks for clicking, though. Thanks for clicking. I do appreciate it. Alright, so we got 40 combo width here. Uh, I'm not really going to mess with any more of this stuff. You're going to be done with that. And after this, there you go. Train as much as you can. Uh, there you go. There you go. Cool. In the meantime, 22 com... Uh, there you go. And, uh, I'll accept for you three divisions. Just go and switch them over. It's fine. And these guys are more than fine. Actually, uh, what do we have here? Any upgrades? Yeah, I'll go with infantry expert. I love me some infantry. Nice. No manpower. Do we need manpower? Probably. Honestly, probably. National Spirit, the legacy of Coltsburt? Not bad. But after this, how many focuses or deputies? Oh, you go down this way. Attract social democrats? Ooh, get more political power. I like one. Make amends with the national syndicalists. But, all right, today controversy has rocketed or rocked the Nation Assemblée Nationale, and the session had to be suspended. Foreign journalists were puzzled as Victor Allard, the Chevalier's firebrand, was yelled at for calling the Second Republic the Second Republic. Many correspondents simply poked fun at the controversy. Conservative and communist leading reporters had a field day ridiculing the event as either a proof of Republican incompetence or as an incomprehensible attack on the Chevalier's. Ice Cream Scoop, the Manhattan Herald correspondent, was the first to make sense of the situation for outside observers, having attended the session and speaking perfect equilium. Having been raised in pair idea, she explained in her piece that the controversy was real and not a simple joke. Aquilian has two words for the second deume, and a seconde, while the latter have been used by all the politicians to describe the current republic, Allard used a former. The controversy sparked from a subtle nuance to say seconde republique means that there have been only two republics, and it carries the idea that there won't be any more. De, uh, do -eme, do -eme doesn't have any of that meaning, and simply states that something is second in a series. Effectively, Allard and Vlad that the current republic has an expiring day. Symbolically attacking the legitimacy of the current regime. Maybe we should find more language, les language lessons. So, I've already read this one when I played as a Harmony route. So, if there's events like these again that have happened, I'll let you guys read them if you really want to read them. But I'm not going to read them from here now. But many members of the World Deer's MPA party have incorporated tenets of social thinking into their policies. These so-called national syndicalists may be convinced to support our government if we promise them nationalist and cultural reforms in, in turn. For we are all equivalent patriots, no? Why shouldn't we work together? Taran joins the Republic. So, hurrah, if you like to about that, please go right ahead. Cool. 
So, like last time when I played as the Harmony Route, this is very nice to get these guys immediately. I'm not even going to bother what they look like, because it doesn't matter what they look like, because they're an army for us. Very cool. And they should be led by Jean Lafitte. Hello, Jean Lafitte. Oh, and also we want to make sure. Now, we're not democracy. We're not democratic, which is, you know, not great for us. A Ghanasan would be very good. And Ghanasans. You could use some military pistol. That, that stuff is good enough. I'll uh, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Anything down here, I don't even want to be bothered with it. No, thank you. But since we're not harmonious... <clears throat> That just means that we don't get a, get more compliance nearly as quickly as we did when we played uh, as a harmony route. So it is what it is. B Battle of Literacy is almost gone. Even though Jean Le Voleur, I don't speak French. I apologize. Oh, look at that. And bitches, Union Boss. I like that. But mm, Technocrat, Consumer Goods. Ooh, I like that one a lot. I like a lot of these. 10%. Ooh, 10%. That's only really 0.2 more. Ooh, I kind of want that. But you know what? We'll grab that. 1.3 right now is not too bad. Irie, 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 Irie feud ends for now. But I make amends with the National Syndicalists. Very good. And we're going to need a lot of people here. We're going to need more support anyway, so... That'll be okay. More popularity to communism. We love communism. But I think we can wait real quick. The build table. Um, let's go ahead and just do... Construct the Vizima Monument. Let's do that one first. Because we get more political power every single day, which is something that we love, 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 love. And then attract the Social Democrats. Oh, the little fledgling dispute. Ooh. Oh, so if you want to read about this, please go right ahead. I prefer the former. I prefer the latter. No, we chose this one last time. But this time we're going to prefer the former. Very cool. Many FJA members are strong advocates of a welfare state that supports the population through government action. If we can show them that we are the only logical continuation of this policy, we will have a guaranteed support from these left FJA members when we attempt our economic reforms. We get more stability, communism, and you get a total of 25 more deputies. Deputés. Deputy somethings. Very nice. The Great Quill ceases to write. If you like to about that, please go right ahead. This happened last time when we played as a harmony group. Very cool. A shame, but the art has its reasons that reason ignores. All right. It is 1,008. Let's grab some construction speed. What are we building up here? Military factories aren't bad. Especially when you need 40,000 guns, 8,200 pieces of artillery, and about 1,000, roughly 1,000 things of support equipment. Oh, that's not good. Uh, let's go and click on that. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. The Vizima Strikes Memorial. If you like to read about that, please go right ahead. Very nice. We will remember the heroes of Vizima. Attract the Social Democrats. We love the Social Democrats. Thank you, thank you. And uh, both of you have the same amount of attack, but you got more recon down here, so. Gerard Simon de Berger. I love de Berger. De Berger, tasty. Merci. I don't speak French. The table built. Let's just get through that one too as fast as possible. 180 support is pretty nice. Crew's looking very, just very astute. It looks like a mouse, but not really. That's a massive nose he's got. And those ears. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Improve working conditions. We're kind of okay for now. Oh, we can do this too. Nice. Um, is, is, is the same thing happen? Like, if you core this. Oh, wait. Oh, we have a cord. Oh, that's kind of cool. Okay. Um, I'm just wondering, like, if we core something... Oh, we got there. We got there. There you go. Nice. But if you get 40% compliance, will we still get cores on stuff? I hope that's still the case. I really do. So, as much as we can do that one, we're... Ooh, this one's not bad. I like the one a lot. This one's okay. Uh, that one's not too bad. This one's not bad. Not great. Not bad. This one's... Eh, it's okay. This one's not bad. I like that output. We can really use that output right now, actually. Ooh. But compliance-wise... We don't really need any more compliance. So, but I'm going to grab some army XP next, because that's the most important one. We're going to need 150. That's fine with me. Alright, if you like to read about the table bill, please go right ahead. And which word is going to go to the National Archive next? Bon appetit, messieurs les députés. Give them an allowance of being done with it. They'll eat what they get in their plates. I think I went with this one last time, but... Ooh, the defect. The best option will reduce the cooldown of all political decisions by 20 days. Ah, let's go do that one. one. I, li I like the cooldown. I like cooling down faster. Fast cooldowns are just great with me. Man, we're going to need a lot of manpower. Oh, baby daddy. But we love the Social Democrats, too. If they vote with us. Or vote for us. 
Uh, ooh, what is this? Political power, production, growth, acceptance of communist diplomacy, stability, communism, and factories? Nice. Ensure that the various unions across Aquilia have political representation at lower levels will strengthen the ties between our government and said unions. Tying pad politics and union industrial activity together will lose us some support in the assembly, but the productivity and rights of the workers are worth it. Very cool. Yeah, getting 20 days, that's, <laughs> that's, that's just better. Like, don't get me wrong, that's just better. Nice. We definitely need more army XP as well, so... Good, good, good. And you know what? Screw it. Just do this one, too. Because we need a lot of armies where we're headed. A lot of armies. A lot of strong divisions. Uh, well, that would be a waste of time. Just let time go on. Thank you very much. And we'll go with... Simon Guibarta. Oh. Let them kill each other. Where the nation's memory lies. If you'd like to read about that, please go right ahead. Yeah, thank you. Oh, we need some more to pee, pee The capital will do just fine. Really, it is... So we did this one the last time when we played the Supreme the Harmony Rock. I keep calling them supremacists. They're not supremacists, they're harmony folk. Minovia will do great for us. And happy 1009, my friends. Happy 1009. There we go. And after that, the, the guide Deshimens. Deshimens, if you like to read about that, please go right ahead. But I think it's time to legally abolish the monarchy. But maybe first. Well, this will alienate five of them, so we might not have enough support for this one. Oh no! Oh yeah, we probably will. So, illegally abolish the monarchy. Everything we do as a republic must have a basis in our laws and constitution. This includes removing the last vestiges of a monarchy and embracing democracy. Though we topple the discrets through force and bloody revolution, their end cannot truly be made real until the ink dries on our new constitution. Whip the party? Crack that whip! We love whips! But we gotta break the chains that affects all ponies, and or just really just griffins, but maybe ponies too. More communism support. Um, let's see. Now that I've, I've gotten more used to this, so I kind of know what's going on. If you like to about this, please go right ahead. Well, this may be an interesting day. Nice. Very nice. I like the broad illiteracy. We like being illiterate here. Let's do that one. Let's get more support. After the, abolishing the monarchy. Logement d'état. The provision of housing to the poor by the state has long been a proposal of Aquilius socialist movements. We are no different, and we will ensure that all have a place to spend their nights in comfort and that none shall be left living on the streets. While our opponents may lambast this as a pure populism, we stand true to our beliefs that all Aquilians deserve the right to a good life. More monthly population, stability, construction speed? Nice. The Act of Abolition. Today, the Act of Abolition was formally signed into law in the Aquilian, into the Aquilian Constitution, ending the centuries-long rule of the monarchy and enshrining the Republic and democracy as an essential part of the reborn nation. While mostly ceremonial act as heir to the throne, Vivian Descartes is nowhere to be found, many in the general public consider this to be the start of a new era for Aquilia. Newspapers from all over the nation are holding this as a sign that the Republic is here to stay this time. And all major political parties of Aquilia have voiced their support for the paid residents' latest act. Finally, the oppressive system that has ruled the country for so long has truly met its well-deserved end. Long live the Republic? Absolutely. We gotta go there. We need more, uh, political... Pony power. Pony power. I don't want to say the wrong thing, but... Pony power... Now, going down this route, maybe Bicolini wants to kill us. I'm not really sure, so we'll see. We'll definitely see, so. And also, like from the first video, this is on historical, so. Very nice. Uh, uh, yeah, we might as well do that one, why not? We currently only get 1.5 political power every single day, and this will give more pony power, so our divisions can look extra good, and we make more destroyers, I guess? It's alright with me. Destroyers are fine. We got five capital ships. Nice. With the party. Yeah, we can do that one. Nice. Uh, if you like to about Declaration de Exception et des Droits Civils de Ponies, please go right ahead. But I've already done this one before, so it is what it is. Cool. We can kind of close that one out as well. And we will go ahead and work with the Pidna. Might as well. There's really no point to not do it. Actually, how support do we have from. We have. Oh, it's just Pat. I keep looking at FJA because I play them, but we have 130 out of 157. That's not bad. Nice, and work with those guys too. And after this, Academy Republican Death Sciences. If you like to read about that, please go right ahead. And then we can reclaim the periphery. That was actually really fast. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Oh, it's against us four as well. That's okay. Cool. Then we get a whole another research slot, which is going to be very, very beneficial. Man, this mod runs so smoothly, and I love it. Nice. Anything else here? No? Okay. We got the Mage Company, hopefully. And. Uh, we can work with them. Let's let's save our PP for now. 
<sighs> I want to get this one. I like the less resistance target. I really do. Radio is very good too. 10, 9. Let's grab more research speed. Ooh. Yeah. 39 is not enough. Comment side. If you like to build that, please go right ahead. Make a sacrifice to Ma. May the gods be merciful. Boris protect us. Boris. Boris protect us. Actually, we're going to grab this one next. A long time veteran because it gives us more political power. Industrial research speed. Monthly population. Uh, this stuff is all okay. Just for me personally, just not. Just not. Bueno enough. I'll put it like that. Bueno enough. All right. Uh, 15. Yeah, why not? Uh, that's fine. And there we go. Tripartite Union. Slightly more political powers, not very much, but it's fine. Literacy Rage Sword, if you'd like, like to read about that, please go right ahead. Oh, the place is your goal, my friends. Modest literacy. Muy bueno. 10, oh, 9. Let's maybe get some, get some better planes. Yeah, planes are probably good to get. Academy, I'll reclaim the periphery. Aquilia was once a great kingdom, and now we shall make it our own, even a greater republic. The lands to our north are rifle Aquilian provinces, ruled now by a motley collection of misguided griffins and tyrants. We must bring them into the enlightened rule of the republic, and let all experience true freedom. Let all experience true freedom. It's a full three search slot, finally. Ah, oh, very good. Oh, and you need something here. That'd be nice. That's a lot of guns. 47,000 guns. That's a... Huh. That's a lot of guns, man. Not gonna lie. Uh, we could actually probably do this. Yeah, we'll get, get more war support. That'd be pretty good. So after that, and then we'll probably do the Shiny Star of Socialism. With Aquilia on the rise, more and more Griffins credit the Pat with Aquilia's prosperity. We can capitalize on this to force through some legislation that may not have been previously possible. And which... Oh. Oh. The, well, I think the last time we tried this, we're better off on our own. You know, we'll appreciate their help. Why not? We'll do it again since we're kind of democratic as well. But whenever we do the non-aligned, or, or at least when we do the supremacy route, we'll do that one. But we'll do that one. Why not? Skyfall Republic. Join them. That's fine. We claim the periphery. Shining start of a socialism. Can you guys actually win? And this is looking not too good for us, but that's all right. All right. So how about we stop training? And y'all come over here. Actually, House of Eerie, Eerie. Oh, we can't do that one either. Just throw everyone over here if we possibly can, just because, uh, yeah. They're not great. Three, two, one. Can we go to war? Yep. 40 combat with, with like no strength. Maybe not great. Maybe not really good idea to do. But we're still doing it. And we're tried and true. Cool. I don't know. I can rhyme there. Anything else? Uh, basic armored cards. I'll be okay. 10 10. Uh, for this one, you know what? Uh, logistics. I mean, I knew that last time we needed logistic companies, but now we're actually going to grab it. Ooh, yeah, that one too. Uh, Poach deputies. Eh, why not? This one's definitely going to be a little bit more of a struggle, but that just gives us more army XP, right? A little bit of a struggle gives us a little bit more army XP. 6,000 versus 21,000. Not bad, not bad. Could be better, though. Uh, we're kind of okay for now. Support weapons are very, very good. And, uh, what do we want? Want, want. Better ships? Uh, so, a little bit, way too ahead of time. We'll do that one, though. That stuff is usually good to get. Hey, guys are encircled. There you go. Goodbye. Yep, I think we kind of won here. Thank you very much. Oh, we love you. We love you so very much. Not really. Oh, did we lose somebody here? Oh, we might have lost somebody. Uh, did we lose somebody? I just feel like we lost somebody. Oh, what is that? Monthly population, resistance, growth speed, interstates, kindly enigma. Yeah, yeah. Compliance speed, agency upgrades, times, enemy operative detection chance, own operative detection chance, target levels. Yeah, that's just we've got to go down that way, man. All right, not bad. And I don't think we can change this at all, which kind of sucks, but hey, it's all right. All righty, tidy. So let's get everyone over to. Let's go here first. Let's have fun down here. Nice. Three. Two. Shining Star of Socialism. God dang it. Uh, let's see. Integrate the periphery. Yes. 
I want to get that one first just so we can get more cores and such, probably. Even though it would make more sense to go down this way first, probably, so then we lose deputies, we can work on the deputies, and then we can grab them back. So, politicize the unions. While unions have previously only been active on a local political basis, it is time to bring them into the national limelight. Every administrative division, including at the federal level, will have a council of union members that represent the interests of the working at Griffin. This way, the state will always be responsive to the needs of the laborer. Very good. Never forget labor. Three, two, I don't care, just go. Go, 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 go. Ah, Simon. Um, you know, for now, let's, let's get Scavenger. I think the last time we went Fortress Buster with him. Uh, but we need a lot of equipment. Now, you guys are all alone. And we like it when they're alone. So we can raid their booties? Hmm. Let's save her PP for now. Never mind. Let's use our army XP for more of that. Very bueno. Oh, wait, hold on. Can we do it again? Oh, we need 75. That's quite a bit. That's right. And by taking out enemies, we get all of the equipment too, which is just scrum diddly umptious. Hey, look at that! Less than 30,000 guns needed. Only need 8,400 more pieces of artillery. Not bad. Oh, they're actually stopping us. Never mind. Um, goodbye. Goodbye, Jules. Goodbye. Ah, uh, it's so nice when that happens, isn't it? So nice. And who's next? Flo oh, see if... Oh, we... Oh. We, they helped us out last time when we played as, played as them when we were harmonious, but okay. Oh, wait. Uh, ooh. Skyfall Republic, huh? Oh. Well, that sucks. Oh, whoops. Oh, well, I guess we're fighting the Griffonian Republic. Guys, let's all go in, please. We don't have time. Uh, people are invading us right now, quite literally, so. My bad. Uh, they said we could go to war. We might as well, right? They're doing a last stand there. Literally doing a last stand or something. Are they? A proposal from Flavolina. Oh. They told us of the grand plans for a railroad connecting them to the Skyfall Trade Federation. This will create a busy trade route that goes from through our lands. It predicted high profits and said we could get a substantial amount of income from tolls. All we need to do was give them permission to invest in building the railway through our lands. What? Um, I mean, we're killing you, but that, I think that's a great idea. I think that's awesome. Yeah, let's do it. How about we go ahead and integrate the periphery, though? Law may take, may take some time for the Griffins of the periphery to get used to living under Aquilian rule again. They will soon embrace the freedom we offer them with open wings. We will bring cultural and economic prosperity to them, as well as political freedom. What is what is there that is not to love? Seriously, how are they not dead yet? There we go. Now, you guys. Oh. You guys are still there, huh? I really don't want to go to war with the Griffin Republic. That doesn't make any sense to me, but whatever. Go ahead and heal up first. Ah, see if Louina. Very nice. Okay, well, it is what it is, I guess, you know. Sure to realize that, I guess. It literally writes an all-time load. Very nice. If you'd like to read about that, please go ahead. Very good. Yep, I just lost all those guys. Well, this is definitely making it different than before. And get the Navy out there. They need to get out immediately. Well, someone's always going to have to dine out. Now, they want to go to war with me. Let, let it be known that they wanted to go to war with us because we just want a Fluino. And they said no, and I'm like, alright guys, we can play this game. You know what, go extensive a conscription because we're probably going to need it. At least it's definitely different than last time, I and mean, I just lost all the armor. God dang it. And then again, the armor wasn't really super important, at least to me. Infantry, because we're communists, we love infantry. Oh, the Mazda turn. Very nice, very nice, very nice. The killings march. You bet we do. Invest in the people. Education is the fuel for the future of our nation. If we do not invest in our young griffins, then how will they go forward to eventually improve Aquilia as a nation? This goal is one that we should not just pay lip service to, but take the true action in order to better the future prospects of our nation. Nice. But we're going to alienate too many people, so let's do that one. Very good. Um, you guys probably want to help out there, maybe? Yep, look at that. They're literally doing last stand. Till they literally die. I love it. Yeah, the AI, at least in my campaigns, they, not always, not always. They often, though, like to use Last Stand, which I'm totally okay with for them dying, but still. 
Lots of torpedoes, please. Thank you, thank you. Oh, and we got a bait in the rear. God dang it. Well, we might be able to push quickly enough. Nope, never mind. We will not be able to. That sucks, sucks, sucks. There you go. Guys. Do we not deploy them fast enough or something? What's going on? Uh, give me you two. Keep these guys in place. We've lost how many? 32,000 versus 164,000. Well, I guess... Just go on ahead, guys. I guess. Just take their naval base. Sure, why not? Are they... No, they can't be. They're not. Okay, that's fine. Don't let them leave. Do not let them leave. Alright, well... At least it's different. That's all I can say is that at least it's different. Get more common support. That'd be good. Uh, you got one too. Invest in the people. Follow it up with... Ooh, some of that. Nice. Now we can't do anything else because we need to get more deputies. Finish the corporate reforms. If you'd like to read about that, please go right ahead. That'd be good. Increase our society's development level would be very, very nice. And we'll take a look at Colt Bird stuff very soon, but 1010, of course. Oh, that was not too bad. Let's get some more output. We can really use that. Nice. Very good. Looking better here. And guns are looking slightly better, too. Death charge floor is not bad. Let's grab some more construction speed. Please, please, please. Nice. Not toy factories it is, then. Good job, guys. Now head on over there. And switch your generals out to that. Give it a few seconds. Ooh. You know, have everyone hold. Just kind of re reform the line. Get some more planning done. Good stuff like that. Oh, there goes Bronze Hill. Bethesia. 10, 9, 8, 4, 3. Let's go. I swear I can count well. Count real good, man. Other populace, if you'd like to read about that, please go right ahead. President Lacro, President Lacro. Nice. Grab some encryption or decryption power. That'd be very good. How much more manpower do these guys have? They have a lot of resistance, actually. They're out. Now, these guys, I'm sure, have quite a bit. Are they fighting someone else up there? No, probably not. 34,000. Not bad. They will run out very soon because, well, hello. Hello. Salut. Hello. They'll find whatever's up here and raid all the Griffonian Republic's little supply bases. Little supply convoys go bye-bye. And they will forget this. Regret this. Nice. We lost 72,000. Kind of sucks, but that's alright. Alright, whip the party. Yes, we shall. We got more than enough army XP for this, so there you go. Mage Company breakthroughs. Paratroopers, why not? And we got them all done. Oops. My bad. Hey, no circlement. Are they? No, they can't be. Oh, they, yes they are. Their strength is decreasing. Oh, baby boy. What a shame. Yeah, they literally just do... They do last stand more than I do. My goodness. Rebirth of Aquila is very nice to do, actually. Very, very nice. Machine tools. Ooh, I'd like to do a lot of these. Can we do anything down here yet? No, we cannot, which is fine. The Rebirth of Aquila, if you'd like to read about that, please go right ahead. And I really want to make Aquila a great nation. One of the greatest nations. Let's go ahead and grab... Ooh, War Economy might not be bad, actually. I like the Union Boss. We definitely need more output, though. Like, oh my goodness. Yeah, that one's okay. I like the output. Let's do that one. 1.69. Nice. Every day. I love it. We'll hopefully get a piece deal with the Griff... Uh, Republic... What was it? Griffonian Republic. Oh, we actually lost that stuff. Oh, that's not good. Oh, well, that makes sense. Don't do not do that. You guys just go home. There you go. Repair, 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 repair. That's fine. Don't let them leave. Do not let them get any organization. The fall of Bronze Croix. So much for fighting to the end. Yes, 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 yes. Very good, very good. Are they just asking to die? They're literally just asking to die. I'm okay with that. War economy, then. Sack of Skyfall? I mean, wh what do you expect? 
You went to war with us. All I wanted was Loina, and y'all said no. So, wh wh what am I supposed to do? Wh wh what am I supposed to do, man? There you go. We're out of ability to go to war with other people, so... It is what it is. Cool. Civic nationalism. Oh, liberation of... Yes. Li liberation of Loin Tainu. The lands of Verania have been torn between the influence of the Hetzlanders and the Aquilians for centuries. The western half of the duchy of Verania, Loin Tainu, was once part of Aquilia and retains its Aquilian identity to this day. The local governments have suffered much from the Verenians of war and yearn for liberation from monarchical anarchy. Let us attack, then ensure the Imperials never rule these lands. Good, good, good. But we'll get that done as soon as we finish our other focus, which should happen very soon. Oh, Fethizia's gone. I see your point if you like about, read about that, but magnifique, very nice. Political power and party popularity of communism. Oh, how nice. And let's go ahead and work with these guys, because we can. And after this, then we can go ahead. Oh, Bronze goes bye bye. Decryption. Let's grab some encryption or cryptology, I guess. Amend uh, gun ownership. More mobilization speed, div less division training time, more recruitable population factor. Resistance, growth speed, interstates occupies the enemy be are Aquilian and civic nationalism. More daily political power, stability, and compliance growth. I like that compliance. Aquilia is a land of its citizens. This is a founding principle of our socialist ideology that we should never forget. While we are not nationalists in the veins of those black shirts and wing body, or others like them, we are proud... Oh, my bad. We are proud of our nation and of our revolutionary past. Our identity as Aquilians is inseparable from this revolutionary struggle for liberty, and we would do well not to forget it. Very good. 22 days left, that is fine with us. The Empire is doing quite well, which does have me slightly concerned, but we did make 40 combo with divisions, even though we did kill off our own tanks and motorized by accident. My bad! Hopefully I won't do, make a mistake like that next time, so... It is what it is. Oh, pillage bank vaults. Everyone knows that the vaults of Fluvian are full of valuables. Now that we have seized the city and subjugated its populace, nothing stops us from borrowing some cash. Or all of it, permanently. I don't know. I mean, that's nice and all. I don't want to raid their banks, though. Hmm. Civic nationalism, though. Alright, let's move on in. Who is this up here? Eh, it doesn't matter. Let's kill them all off. And let God sort them out. And then again, do communists believe in God? I guess some might. Oh, who is this? Republic of Griffenheim. I like the hat. Elberus White Plume. This was industry, very good. Get rid of some of that too. And it is 10 10, and we want to make sure that our engineers are up to the task. Because we're going to need some of the best engineers in all of the continent here. What is the continent here? What? Uh, let me know in the comments below. I can't remember. What is the continent name for this? Because isn't this equals over here on the left? This one is. Not Canterlot, that's a city in Equestria. Oh, we got him, nice. Well, is there any doubts? Maybe. Maybe, maybe a little bit. That's weird that we, that we can only satellite them. That happened when we played as a, as a Harmony route as well, which I didn't like, but you know, it is what it is. There you go. Go ahead and train as well, maybe? Maybe, maybe, maybe. With the party, yeah. I don't know, should I do this? I don't want to do that, though. That looks very mean. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, commune? Yeah, we'll totally take that. More stuff? Nice. Don't even just bother me with it. Just just throw them on there, guys. Oh, I hope they're mobilizing more. Oh, we're mobilizing hopefully quite a bit more. Wouldn't you go to extensive conscription, though? Oh, that's not going to be good. Oh, did you guys not get the memo? There you go, guys. There you go. This is going to make it harder for us, though, which is not good. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. And actually, we have 240... Five. And how much do we need for this one? We need more manpower, really. Uh, 250. So if we wait a few days, let's go work with these guys, the FJA. And then we should be able to do amend gun ownership laws. The Pony Revolutionary Caramel Marx once said, Under no, pre no pretext should arms be surrendered, any attempt to disarm the workers must be sabotaged by force if necessary. While we refute most of its philosophy, we agree with this statement. In the time before the First Revolution, the monarchy tried to confiscate the weapons of the people and turn them against us. We shall never let this happen again. Never. Ah. Goodbye, guys. Yeah, we definitely gotta go to service bar requirement next. 260, very nice. Let's go ahead and... Oh, Max? I like Max. Especially Big Max. Those are pretty good. Um, too much bread, though. Oh, experimental magic. Oh, baby, yes. 
Yes. Yes, yes, please. Yes. Yeah, looking a little better. 26,000. Not great, but not bad. All right. So we got that done. 10, 11, 10. Not 10, 11 yet. Like I almost just said. Uh, radar. I like the radar. I like the things that go wee, wee, wee. Frontline organizations. I think for this one, I'm going to choose Messenger Enchantments. I chose this one when we play Harmony, but I think the next two routes, I'll probably go with Quick Hitters. We'll probably do that. But first, let's grab some output. We need Enchant Machines. Maybe we'll see what happens. All right, so now we got to make sure we really prepare ourselves because we might be having an incoming conflict very, very soon, and it's probably not going to look very, very good for us. More communism? Sure, why not? At least we're still mo mobilizing more. And we need... 250 deputies. All right, that is good to know. Uh, 10, 10, 10, 11. Oh, we haven't done any of this stuff. Oh, my goodness. Oh, just go to Superior Fire Park because it's tried and true, you know. Good goal. It's a different route, like, um... Mass Assault. We should, we, ah, we should, we, should, we should go down Mass Assault for this one. That seems like it would make more sense for us, but... I don't want to. I don't want to have a, a very difficult time. I want to enjoy my experience playing Equestria War. So we, if we go with Mass Assault, I will not enjoy this nearly as much. Just saying, <laughs> just saying. So uh, let's go ahead and do. Ooh, yes, Agricultural Modernization Committee. If you'd like to read about that, please go right ahead. But I've already read through literally every single one of them already once, so I don't really want to read them through them again, at least for now. So with the party, you bet we're going to get the whips out. And that's actually really nice. That all this is done already. So thank you. Come again. Prospect for resources, we can actually open that up for later on. Political power is very good. We do... You could use some rubber right now. Uh, sure, why not? And our navy did actually okay. We only lost a few screens, so actually I'm kind of okay with that. So go train until you don't die. Do that for now. You guys did relatively okay. Relatively okay. Could have been better, of course, but it was okay. How are we doing with this stuff? Oh, cost, oh wow. That's a weird word to say. Wow, that's a lot of resistance. That is a lot of resistance. Wow. That's actually really not good. Why do we have so much resistance? Let's get some military police then. Is it just because we're out of guns? Well, I put them to be on high. Oh, it's because we're out of manpower. That's why. Duh. Duh, Mr. Muckle Lover. Duh. Save on manpower then. Alright, well, I guess no more manpower then. Goodbye. Wow, that's really bad. That is incredibly bad. Superior firepower, though, so... Especially when we're out of manpower. We're still mobilizing quite a bit, though, which is nice. Alright, up next, can we do the next one? No, we cannot. That's fine. Mm -hmm. The Metropole Development Commission, if you'd like to read about that, please go right ahead. But, I've already read that once. We got a lot of pat. I like it. Advanced machine tools, that'll be good. Extraction would be okay. Engineering, get, grab some radar. That's fine. And how are we doing for resistance? We should have this all... Okay, good. We're getting more compliance every day. That's good. And actually, do we have any spies? Let's get, some, let's, let's get a spy agency going so we can put down resistance. Uh, La Chouette? That's not too bad. That would be probably really important to do, too. So Why not? At least we're still mobilizing. Oh, baby. Maybe we took them out too fast. Probably a little bit too fast. And work with them. And which we'll get. How many? 15? So that'll be 270. How many do we need for this one? And China Machines, that's good. Ah, we can do that one. But we'll read about that after we get this one done. Mm, next factory's in a state. That's okay. 10, 10. 10, 11. It's almost here. Uh, 10, 11. Let's go for that one then. Le Travelers du Monde Usunissant. We've succeeded in throwing off our own chains of tyranny, and we've created a haven for the worker within our own borders. It is now the duty of our evolution to go ahead and fight for the rights of all the workers of the world. And if you are a worker, you too are part of the Workers' United Front. Come, let us assist our comrades in their struggles against oppression. Send military missions to war-torn socialist or harmonist nations. Oh, that's cool. What is that one? Oh, weekly, weekly stability. Oh, that's kind of nice. Good. Let's go ahead and do this one. I want to put resistance down. That'd be nice. And that one too. Mm, yeah, we're gonna wait. Work with these guys for now. Yeah, we'll gladly take some stuff. That's not bad. Anti tank. I'm not gonna use anti tank probably either. Guns are looking way better. Artillery is looking really good as well now. That's not too bad. Not too bad. Not too shabby. Do we actually have a little bit of manpower? Maybe. Nope. Okay. 
Nice. Nice. Okay. Uh, diplomatic stuff. Smoocher. Yeah. Oh, if Paul can smooch, we want him. Root at resistance. Oh, it's so bad around here. Let's do. Can we do all four? Oh, that's nice. Now I can get all that stuff. That's really good to get that. Urban development. Oh, civilian factories. Yes, yes. There you go. Why not? Doesn't really matter to me. Nice. And let's keep going down here. National Ge Geological Survey. Might as well, right? Might as well. Go compliance looks like it's going all up. Hopefully we can get up to 20% as quickly as possible. That is the most important thing for us to do right now. And get this stuff done as well. From military factories, a word from the private republic. We received a word from the well-known revolutionary Comrade General Philip Redglad. They want to join the faction we created to help bring global communism to this world. Ooh. What is that? Pry win. Ooh. Do they go to war with other people? I don't want to end up in a in a war. Of course they can join. Sure. Ooh, is that good to do? I don't know. That might not be good to do for now. Hmm. 50 day focus. Wow. Oh, crap. Guys. Uh, should we do that one? Are you guys at war with somebody? Um. Oh, no. They want to join our wars. Auckland, Socialist Republic of Scandinavia. Wait. Commune of Irie. Aquilian. Ah, sure. You guys can come on in if you really feel like it. I mean, it feels just so inclined. I did forget we are technically at war still, so. You guys, good luck. We have no more civvies. I guess we can wait. Changing a question border, very nice. Tough. Oh, that's not bad. I prefer Hugo. He's a little, he's a little tough. There you go. Not bad. Really not bad at all. Go and do that. And we need more deputies. Yes, we do. Very good. And clear out the marsh. Yeah, let's go and just do that. Let's just go ahead and do it. That's fine. Not bad. Can we do anything else down south? No, we cannot. Oh, big sadness. All right. Uh, this is railways. I love railways. Military factories. I kind of want to get railway military factories as fast as possible. If you like about that, please go ahead. Um, a seeds of a new generation of cooks have been planted or pursued. Good. Support technology. I like the attack. I kind of want more some more defense right now though. This would not be bad because we do need more manpower or pony power. Uh, third branch is okay. Not really super super important to do. I kind of like the shipyards too, but I'll do probably a machine tool modernization because that's usually pretty good. New Sky Navy burns? As it probably should, right? As it probably should, right? Hmm. 10, 11. More research speed is always good to get. And some free naval XP. We enjoy it quite a bit here. Alright, 257. Work with the pair. Yes. Radio detection is very good. Artillery. Let's get some better artillery. How much anti air do we have? That's not bad. That's looking so much better. Oh my goodness. If you like to bit the Irie uh, fire competition, please go right ahead. Nice. That's fine. Please tell me we're still mobilizing. We are. We still, we're about three quarters of the way there. So we got a little bit of time. Whip the party. Um, That's not really worth it. I'd rather work with the Pidna and then maybe whip the party. Maybe. We'll see. Oh, the City of Skyfall has been... Hmm. Goodbye. We need 275. One of the most hotly debated parts of the Quillian Constitution is a function of the executive office. Our political stance has always been limit to limit the executive and devolve more power into the Assemblée Nationale and have them be the primary driving force behind our democratic system. Our president is not to become a dictator and that these restrictions make sure of that, which would be good to do very quickly. Very, very quickly, actually. Go and do that. Ah, we do have enough for that. Nice. With the party. Oh, uh, no, we're pretty good already. Oh, okay. Whoa, that is ugly. Thank you, Griffoni Navar. Thank you. Now we'll probably fight them ourselves, but then uh, we're we're really not ready for any sort of war. We got to get up to forty percent compliance, don't we? Compli Do we get any more compliance with anybody else here? No, no, no. Big sadness hours. Keep picking up an industry, too. Industry is very nice to get. Let's put one there, and then we'll put it... Uh, 40, 60, 60. There you go. Not bad. 
We could end up going to war as well right now. We don't really want to do it, though. So, they're... Are they fighting... Are they just fighting the Skyfall Republic? They are. Huh. Okay, well, they do them. Sounds good to us. Just them. The Great War, very good, very good. And develop all that stuff we can. We'll do that later. With the party... Meh, no. More communism here. And they'll probably go with probably some more defense with infantry and such like that. That's probably kind of important to do. But limited the exec presidential executive power. Nice. Very good. And I guess technically we're on our own since they technically still exist, but they're kind of by themselves. So I guess we're on our own for now. Oh, division training time, organization, attack, military factory construction. We kind of, kind of can wait for all this stuff. That's not bad, though. We can wait. But I'm going to go ahead and I'll show you some of these. I might just play a little bit more off screen here, but... You know, well, in the next episode, we'll go to war with the Griffonian Empire, probably, and have a good old time with them. But let's do the tax cuts for the arms industry. But, now actually, I showed you some of them as well, just in case. I want to show you this one, because I would like to get here. So I showed you this one, this one, this one, this one. Refurbish those. The Fiat de Naval Reform Plan. Infantry Support Tank Development. The Queen of the Battlefield. Field Support Battalions. And the Third Branch of the Military. But, let me enjoy the video. Leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you tomorrow, as we will probably go to war with the Griffonian Empire, and probably finish off the Griffonian Republic as well. Thanks for watching, have a great communist rest of your day.